So I'm actually headed to CES 2026 and I'm preparing by testing some external NVMe enclosure so I can record some content for you. That brings me to trying out one of the Oracle NVMe enclosures. So let's quickly see what's in the box. The first thing that we see is a little manual. The enclosure comes with a magnetic ring in case you need to attach it to something. Comes with a little screwdriver. Comes with a Type-C cable included so you can connect it to your phone or other devices. Looks like a spare screws and of course the enclosure itself. So this enclosure has a 10 gigabit per second USB Type-C connector, has an SD card slot, a micro SD card slot, and a 100 watt USB Type-C pass-through for power. To open this up, it's just gonna be one little screw up here and we're gonna use the included screwdriver. Then we're gonna open this up completely. There's a little thermal pad and this is what the inside of the enclosure looks like. Looking at the sides, it looks like this enclosure is compatible with NVMe 2230 and 2240 drives. We're gonna pair the enclosure up with a 512 gig NVMe SSD. And to lock this in, just use one of the included screws and then just put the cover right back on. Now it should be ready to use in format, so plug in a USB Type-C and plug it into your device. Now you could rapidly transfer files from and to the drive itself. Very, very fast. Not only can you use it with your laptop, since it is magnetic, it is compatible with the iPhone. So you can put it right on your iPhone and use it as an external storage for your device. Plug it right in with the Type-C cord and you're ready to go. Looks very neat. So if you're curious about this NVMe enclosure, I'll leave a link down in the description below. I'm currently still testing this and so far it looks good.